20X1000 from DMG Mori. Congratulations on your most recent purchase, Peter. Thank you. Why did you go for the machine? Well, we're looking at broadening the scope of work that we can offer our customers. The NTX1000 gives us a huge amount of capability. You've got milling capability on there with 76 tools. We've got two spindles, a lower turret, which is fully driven, a robot to load it, and a bar feed. I mean, you've just got everything, haven't you, there? <laughs> yeah, it's basically the ultimate machine. Yeah. Oh, amazing. So with your milling section, you wanted to, you had an idea and it's worked for you. So what's this going to do for you? Well, essentially the same. I mean, we've got automation and five axis up in the milling department, and that's worked extremely well over the past few years. The idea here is that we emulate it in the turning section so that we can run 24 seven. And it's more complex parts that you're trying to make as well, off in one. That's right. I mean. We currently uh, do a lot of turning work that then goes up into the milling department. This machine will allow us to do it all in one, coming off the machine complete. And what features did you go for? Because you didn't just go for the standard machine, did you? No, so we've upgrade, upgraded the uh, spindle carousel with uh, extra tools. Why did you go for that? That's really, once again, what we found in the milling department was when you have a lot of tools sat in the back of the machine, your setup times are reduced dramatically. Plus you can do far more complex work because you don't have to break your job down into two sections, perhaps. Then we also upgraded the spindle, so we got 20,000 RPM uh, driven tooling on there. And again, why did you go for this? Once again, we do a lot of aluminium work here. So for the aluminium work, we can hit it faster and finish the job quicker. We can also run any other standard uh, materials on the machine as well. And then other than that, we've got 80 bar through spindle coolant. Uh, and we've got a number of options on the machine to allow us to go faster and quicker than we would do otherwise. And you've set it all up as a cell, haven't you? Why did you do that? Well, it's really, I mean, it's a benefit to the guys. The guys love working with new technology, so this is really cutting edge. Also, it allows us to load the components up overnight. They'll run over the weekend. That gives our customers uh, much more capability from us, and it also helps our bottom line as well. Is this going to open up a new world of parts for you then to be able to produce to customers? Yeah, I mean, it's a full five axis machine. So not only can we do all the standard turning and milling work on there, but we can do full five axis as well. So that will really broaden the scope of the type of work that comes off that machine and off to our customers. And do you think by having a machine like this and customers knowing this, you're going to get more work and you're going to get more customers ultimately. Well, that's the anticipation. <laughs> it's uh, not been in long, has it? No, it hasn't been in long. So um, literally a couple of months. So we're, we're just getting up and running and proving it through at the moment. Who's ultimately going to benefit from this investment then? So there's three benefits really. One for our employees. We're upskilling our guys. They're getting the uh, exposure to the latest equipment out there on the market. We've also got a benefit ourselves because we can now offer more complex uh, work to our customers. So we broaden our customer base. And finally, our customers are going to be able to put more work our way because we're going to have three times as much capacity on this machine that we do on our current machines. Now, whose idea was it to have an integrated solution? Well, it came from us upstairs, really. We sat down and decided what our company needs and what it really needs is the latest technology lathe, but also with automation applied to it. So we sat down and decided this would be the ideal solution for us. And training for yep. this to happen? So the training has been really good. We've had uh, three or four weeks worth of training on the actual machine and a Hydrofeed have come in and also provided training on the robot. So what's your end goal for having this machine in your facility then? Really, it's to replace the existing machines we've got, broaden our scope of supply to our customers and increase our customer base. And hopefully we look to have more, more of these in the future.